Hey guys, this is Cameron Garrett from Making Faces and Tutus. This is my model, Pippi the Clown, and we're here on behalf of Face Paint Shop, which is www.facepaintshop.com. And we're going to paint a rainbow butterfly. We're going to use these new little Always Wicked Art petal sponges. Um, I'm going to spray my sponge a couple times and I'm going to use the Cameron's Bliss Custom One Stroke. Actually, this is a, the larger split cake. I'm just loading back and forth. And these are really great for small faces. We're going to put it in the corner of her eye. And just push a couple times. So the color is nice and bright. And then I'm going to squish it to make it smaller and just do a little bit of color in the corner of her eye. This looks pretty simple, but looks really good on little tiny faces. Whatever you do on one side of the face, do on the other. Squish it. And a small bit at the bottom wing. Glitter. Now she's just adding some pink holographic glitter. Very good. Okay, for the one stroke. Here Cameron has moved to the small Rainbow. split cake. We're going to load the brush with not a ton of the purple. You want the strip to be nice and clear. So if you hold it up, the water tends to run down to the bottom. And we're just going to do one stroke of a rainbow from one wing to the other, one wing to the other, and use the eyebrow as a guide. So after that brush is fully loaded, the rainbow goes from one eyebrow to the next. This is the tag number six angle brush, and I'm loading the purple from the outside of the split. I'm going to start right here, I'm going to push, and then release, and then coming in. You don't have to go all the way down either. So now we're going to do wiggle, pull it in. So here she is wiggling and pulling it in and taper it towards the model's eye so you give a nice shape to it. And do about two more little strokes. And you can even use your finger to kind of gently bend. Soften it. We're going to do the same thing on this side. So we're going to start at the top and push. Okay, this is my number four low for now round. I'm loading the same purple. Make sure it's not too wet, so I'm gonna blot on a towel. We're just going to do a few little streamers. Not a lot of pressure. Now Cameron is loading the teal from that cake and adding more streamers. I'm using chameleon white, which I really like because I was not able to get my wool. Um, but I like it. The consistency is really nice. And we're, all we're going to do is add some little detail dots. Turn this up. And we're going to do a little cluster of different sizes. And then two or three little teardrops. And then fill in with some more little streamers. And the other side. Now she's just adding a few more sparkle spots with her white. Two little teardrops. And a few teardrops. All right, now we're going to add the final touch, some lips with some bright tag magenta. And then we're going to use some pink glitter, make a kissy face. Pucker up those lips and more pink holographic glitter. Cool. 